Hi everyone. <clears throat> um, I wanted to do a couple quick calls because I haven't been able to do them recently. We've been looking for houses to uh, live in. That's what you do in houses, right? Um, anyway, uh, I got a couple hauls and I want to start off with the one from, um, it's a combination of like um, Tuesday morning and big lots and home goods. So at home goods I only found uh, these and they're like do-it-yourself tapes and that one looks like it's chalkboard surface so I hope I can use a white pen or I don't know if I have a white sharpie pen. I know I have a one and this is like a silver and copper. I got this for Valentine's Day called Valentina collection by Anna Griffin. It, um, I don't know if it's paper, border stickers, they're border stickers. Then I got these from, um, Crate Paper Sleigh Ride, they're Brad's. These are $1.49. When my husband goes with me, he picks up stuff too, so he not only treats me to stuff, he enables. So this one is, he got it because he liked this one button, because it said so stinking cute. And we found Flare. And this is from American Crafts, but I bought a paper stack at Hobby Lobby with that exact same fox. So I have that. So now I have something that goes with that, and I'll show that in another video with my Hobby Lobby stuff, because it's a lot. Um, I found these Dear Lizzie feathers for $1.49. These are cute. I found two of these, and since Valentine's Day is coming up, I figured I could use them. $1.49 also. I found some Studio Calico uh, badges. And I found these felt stickers. For dollar forty nine, they're kind of that one says thanks, I think. I can't see. Um, fall themed, so I figured they'd go with that stack. And then um, I bought two of these, and I already used one of them for card making. I ran out of the cards that I made, so they're vellum and they're stitched. They look really cute from Slay Right from Crate Paper. I got. Uh, this at Big Lots for $1.50. It's the basic gray die cut shapes from, it's the Aspirin Frost collection. So I guess this was from last year, but it works just as well this year. And I bought another foam tape for $1.50. Because foam tape is crazy expensive at the craft stores, and I'm not going to do that. And uh, I got this at Archivers. Because I wanted it something more compact. So I can keep track of the Copic morphers that I got. And then um, I got Alphas at Tuesday morning. Surprise, surprise. But I went to one that's located further away from me. From my house. And I found a bunch of Alphas. Or stickers. This one is Fellow. And it doesn't have the color, but I, I like the font. I only found one of those. I usually try and pick up two. This stickers is the um, kitten font in a pool color. So it's like a silvery blue. So I got two of those. And then I got this one because I don't have white alphas. And white are good because you can you can color them with your Copics or markers or whatever. Um, in any color that you need, so I figured eight pages of alphas in the Getty font in white for two ninety nine, and it's got seven hundred plus stickers, so that was a good one. And everybody's favorite, the gold stickers. They're called Daiquiri. I wanted there was like six packs of these. I wanted to get all six of them, but I. I bought plenty of alphas, so I figured I'd compromise. 
Uh, this is a cool, like, burlap font. Um, or burlap material. And the font is called a Hello. And I found another kitten alpha, but in silver. And, oh. I guess I had two of those. I did find another one. That one is called the Fellow. Or just Fellow. And then I only found one of these. These are called Josh. And they're printed foil letter stickers also. They remind me of like superhero letters or high school letters. And then I also found another Dear Lizzie um, chipboard sticker set, the trinket. But this one is a different color than the one that I found last time. So I think they might have had a misprint. Or a mistake because this one seems a lot more colorful. The other one was just kind of beige and turquoise. So I wonder what happened. And the last font that I got is the Amy Tangerine Wish in the Robin Zed color. Totally like these. So that's what I got at um, at Big Lots, Home Goods, and Tuesday Morning and um, Archivers. So that's it for now. Um, the other one's going to be a bit longer. I guess I'll include something else in this one. I got this at Hobby Lobby, and it was like, it was on clearance. Um, but it was that Smash, the Kane Company Smash book, the uh, holiday one that comes with the, with the book. I'm not going to open it, or maybe I will. <laughs> but it had really cute Christmas pictures, and I didn't know that it had inserts in the book. So I haven't done a December daily and I was checking my photos and I think I took pictures pretty much the whole month. So I think I might do my December daily in this one or I might leave it and make a mini album this year because I have a lot of paper. And it came with this book strap. It came with these for sure. That one's cute. Jolly good, naughty, nice, super fun. Um, and it came with a booklet for journaling spots. Let's see. It came with this roller date stamp, which I bought already at Target, so I'm going to give this one to a friend. And it came with a washi tape. So it says, can you check the list? Year in review. Want it, naughty, nice, and holiday. This could be the year. Wrap it up, festive check the list. So it's got a lot of sayings in red, in the red color with gold letters. It's really cute. So that's it for now before this gets too long and then I will show you that little haul <laughs> of stuff from um, from Michaels in another video. Thanks for watching. Click like and subscribe if you want. Oh and thanks to my new subbies for subscribing. Good night.